David Hakini is a British artist and now lives in Los Angeles. In the first lesson, when we randomly searched for artists on the website, I was attracted by David's landscape painting. After finding a book that collected his landscape uh, painting in the library, I found that his painting were more vivid. David is a person who likes nature very much. In more than 300 pages of book, it is full of different forests, fields, and paths in different seasons. He is also a modern artist who follows the development of science and technology. He his work of Art involved photography, video, and digital drawing. After the early oil painting, he had a lot of iPad or iPhone drawing too, but he still focused on landscape. Hi everyone, I'm visiting Washington DC during Thanksgiving and I'm so excited about this trip. As we all know, DC has many famous art museums and I hope to find some of David's painting in DC. Okay, today we came to Smithsonian American Art Museum because Google shows that there is a painting of David on view. I hope we can find it. Let's go. Here are some portraits of famous people or artists. It is said that David's self-portrait was shown here, but now they have been moved. And then a new match of artists' portrait are displayed now. Yes, yes, this is the artwork of David we are looking for. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh my god, this is so big, like big than I thought. It was displayed in the first one and can be seen just after entering the door. Oh, it's amazing. The museum uh, gave a lot of space to this work and people can sit down and view this artwork. This painting is three-dimensional with bright colors. It will give people a strong visual experience. In terms of stage play, the color of the light changes. It will give audience different feeling about the artwork. The artworks in this exhibition hall are most three-dimensional creation form of science and technology. It shows that David's paintings are still at the forefront of the times. I'm very glad to have the opportunity to see the work of this artist who tortured me a lot because of project. Although it is not related to landscape painting, it is still very David style. After research, I know David likes nature very much. He used to spend near half a year to paint the same forest path. Although not going every day, he may draw three paintings a week. The change in the tree and path can be clearly seen from the book. While reading the book, I found that one of my projects was very similar to one of David's composition. It took David more than a year to record the changes in the three same trees in the four season with oil paintings. Through painting, we can clearly see the difference in the leaves of the tree. The mountain and fields in the background also have great changes. For me, I found a fixed spot in Juniata to take picture starting this spring. After the first snow, which two weeks ago, I finally had a photo of the season, scenery of four seasons. To feel more change, I began to try to draw these four photos like David. In the, pro, in the process of painting, my focus is mainly on the change in the leaves at the beginning. Since I started painting in the spring, I didn't notice the pine tree in the back. However, when I paint into fall, the other leaves turn yellow, but when the pine was still green, I just noticed that.
I like to use the time lapse to record the process of painting in life or sunrise and sunset. Watching the painting being displayed in more than 20 seconds made me feel that time was recorded by us in another way. For me, time is measured not by clocks but by memory.